Hello and welcome to the news from Bahrain International with me Keith Johnston. Under the patronage of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa and in the presence and follow-up of the representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs and Honorary President of Bahrain Royal Equestrian and Endurance Federation, a brief, His Highness Sheikh Nas bin Hamad Al Khalifa, the races of His Majesty the King's Endurance Cup continue, organised by brief at Bahrain International Endurance Village. The juniors category for the 120 km races of His Majesty the King's Endurance witnessed strong competition and a wide participation where His Highness's follow-up and encouragement had a great impact on the riders and participants. The first place winner in His Majesty's Cup Championship for the junior category was the rider Ahmed Saleh al Noemi from the Al-Ra'ud team. The second place rider Sultan Abdulaziz al Ramehi from Al Zaim's team and Hamad Halal Akhatiri from the Al-Fasan team in a third place. The Vice President of the Supreme Council for Environment and Deputy Chairman of the Coordination, Implementation and Follow-up Committee at the Supreme Council for Youth and Sport, His Highness Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa, and Brief President His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Abdullah Al Khalifa were also present. His Highness Sheikh Nas bin Hamad Al Khalifa expressed happiness with the advanced levels presented by the riders participating in the race for the junior category noting that these levels are indicative of the continuous development of the riders' capabilities. His Highness explained that the wide participation of riders and stables in the races is a great incentive to continue providing full support in order to continue organising the various championships in the Kingdom, which has become the capital of endurance sports in the Arab world, in light of the widespread participation from various countries of the world. The Bahrain International Endurance Village will be the stage for hosting the championships of the endurance season by holding the main race for the Cup of His Majesty the King for a distance of 160 kilometres. It was decided to crown the winners of the 120 kilometre junior competition tomorrow, Saturday, during the award ceremony of the 160 kilometre championship. Under the patronage and presence of the representative of His Majesty the King for Humanitarian Work and Youth Affairs, His Highness Sheikh Nas bin Hamad Al Khalifa, the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club organised the 16th race of the season, which was held for the Cups of His Highness Sheikh Nas bin Hamad Al Khalifa and the Cups of His Children, Her Highness Sheikh Hashim bin Nasser Al Muhammad Al Khalifa, His Highness Sheikh Hamad, Hamad bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa. His Highness Sheikh Mohammed bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and His Highness Sheikh Hamdan bin Nasser bin Hamad Al Khalifa and the Rashid Club Equestrian Horse Racing Cup on the club race track in Al Rafa, Sakir. The race was also attended by the Vice President of the Supreme Council for the Environment, His Highness Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa and the Vice President of the Supreme Authority of the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club. His Highness Sheikh Nasser presented the Highness's Cup for the eighth round to Sultan bin Shuraim, for the fifth round to the winner Terry Keane, while His Highness Sheikh Nasser received His Highness's Cup for the sixth round from His Highness Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa, after the horse Sabrina from Victoria Stable won the first place in the sixth round, while His Highness Sheikh Faisal bin Rashid Al Khalifa presented the first half cup to the winner Abdullah Kuwaiti and the third half cup to the winner James Nyla and the fourth to the winning owner, Ibrahim Alafo, and the seventh half cup went to Mohammed Khaled Abdurrahim, while the executive director of Rashid Equestrian Horse Racing Club, Sheikh Salman bin Rashid Al Khalifa, 
presented the club's cup to the conscience winner, James Nyler. His Highness expressed pride and eagerness to implement the directives of His Majesty King Hamad bin Isa Al Khalifa regarding the need to support the various equestrian and horse sports in the kingdom in a way that contributes to preserving its original history as well as working to develop its level. Noting his keenness to support the efforts and development steps undertaken by the Rashid Equestrian and Horse Racing Club, headed by the Honorary President of the club, His Highness Sheikh Abdullah bin Isa Al Khalifa, and the Chairman of the Supreme Authority of the club. His Highness Sheikh Isa bin Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, in order to promote horse racing in the kingdom. The Minister of Education, Dr. Majid bin Ali Al Nawemi, participated in the sixth virtual meeting of the Board of Directors of Riyadh based Regional Centre for Quality and Excellence in Education, which is operating under the supervision of the United Nations Educational, Scientific and Cultural Organisation, UNESCO. As a board member, Dr. Ali Nawemi appraised the greater and distinguished support accorded to the centre by the custodian of the two holy mosques, King Salman bin Abdulaziz Al Saud and the Crown Prince, His Royal Highness Prince Mohammed bin Salman bin Abdulaziz Al Saud. He stressed the centre's numerous achievements and the efforts exerted by its personnel over the past period. The meeting also included a welcome speech by Minister of Education and Board Chairman Dr Hamad bin Mohammed Al Sheikh, in which he underlined the importance of the centre and its role in improving the quality of the education in the Arab countries. He also pointed out the centre's continuous implementation of its programmes in 2020, despite the challenges related to coronavirus COVID-19 pandemic. The meeting spotlighted various issues pertaining to the educational field in Arab countries. Discussions also focused on the centre's financial report, as well as the strategic plan for 2020 to 2028 and its budget for 2021. The attendees also reviewed the centre's activities and programmes in 2020, as well as the agreements and memoranda of understanding signed in this year. They also agreed to boost cooperation with the Centre for Information and Communication Technology in the Kingdom of Bahrain. Ministers from Arab countries, as well as experts and officials from the Kingdom of Saudi Arabia took part in the meeting. The national vaccination campaign continues to witness a wide turnout of citizens and residents. The Ministry of Health announced that 5,842 had taken the vaccine yesterday, bringing the total number of vaccinated individuals to 263,422. The Ministry renewed its call for the community to commit to all precautionary measures and take the initiative to register for the coronavirus vaccination. The Ministry of Health said today that the number of coronavirus cases reached 7,642 with 633 recoveries, 648 registered new cases and four deaths. 210 of the new registered cases are expatriates, 433 are contacts of active cases and five are travel related. The Ministry expresses its heartfelt condolences to the families of the deceased and urges everyone to comply with the guidelines issued by the National Task Force for Combating the Coronavirus. <laughs> 